Hello, everyone, and welcome to another Just Watched with me and Billy, and we finish off Danganronpa. Yeah! So, the final four episodes. <laughs> Billy, how much for, of a loop were these throwing you for? A little bit of a loop. A little bit of a loop, you say. <laughs> So, we start with episode 10, which is the discovery of the 16th student, and we gotta figure out who killed them. Yeah. <laughs> the mystery mask person. The mystery luchador person who <laughs> chose again. <clears throat> Except for now they're dead. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and what were your thoughts when we found out that the luchador guy was dead? Because I thought it was the mastermind. You thought it was the mastermind? Nope. Nope. <laughs> you thought it was the mastermind, but it was just a corpse. <laughs> <laughs> a wild What? A wild corpse. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, you gotta love that ex when someone rakes the mask to explode. Yeah. Man, who rakes a corpse? <laughs> Don't look at me like that. <laughs> it's because I love Corpse Explosion as a spell in the friggin' Diablo 2. <laughs> yeah. So, um, we move into a trial where our main hero is found guilty. Yeah. <laughs> now, how much of, like, what the fuck's going on here did you have? Thinking like, okay, we're gonna make him look like they're not gonna kill him off. Are you sure? <laughs> I'm. I mean, were you 100% sure on that fact going in? Okay, 99% sure. Because the 1%, I'm thinking like, this is an anime, so this could really throw you a curveball. It really can. <laughs> There's no guarantees or safety that's an anime, sir. Yeah. <laughs> But no, you were right to assume that Nagi is not going to die yeah. here. And gets saved by a, one more unlikely. Yeah, yes. <laughs> Alter Ego saves the day one last time. <laughs> to Monokuma's despair. <laughs> oh, he was pissed. pissed. <laughs> I'm supposed to have Pancake Kid tonight. <laughs> 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 oh, so many, so many lines. oh yeah. And then he just gets dumped in the garbage I was Like, well, he could just rock down there, and that'll be fucking punishment enough, I guess. <laughs> but uh Kira Gary comes down and saves him after because she basically threw him under the bus during the drive. Yeah, because like this is my bad. Well it's like, look. I need you to take a fall for me here because I need to actually accomplish something real quick. Yeah, it's me. I'm I can't when I'm stuck in the basement. <laughs> and we find out that the mastermind is like, I was trying to kill Kiri Yuri, the detective girl, but Niagi, the main hero, was being a pain in my ass. Yeah. So one of them had to die right there. <laughs> So after we, we get out of this, but this is probably ele episode 11 now we're in, too. Yeah. Um, a tall climb out of the base. That was a hell of a fucking fall yeah. to survive. I know. <laughs> I was like, man, that guy was in the middle of the track. I know. They got it a little bit like, sharp or broken. Yeah. <laughs> man, it's probably if you would land on that couch and there's a spring sticking out. Oh, God. <laughs> Ooh. Anyways, so, they confront Monokuma, who, um, basically challenges them to, they challenge him to the final showdown. Mm -hmm. uh, basically, the rules, basically, figure out three things, and I'll let you go. Yeah. You gotta figure out who killed, uh, the mysterious student X. Yep. The purpose of the school. The purpose of the school, and who is the mastermind. And thus, episode 12 is our investigation. Yeah. 
Or no, episode 11 is our investigation. Episode 12 is our trial. Trial. Yeah. Big, 13. Yeah. Big reveal and wrap up is 13. Yeah. yeah. So a lot happens in four episodes. Yeah, I know. Yeah, like it, it just throws everything at you. Oh, God, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's basically, this is the finale. Yeah. And we're going to wrap everything up mm -hmm. as best we can. Considering we're a game out adaptation and the game kind of, this would be like a few hours of gameplay. Yeah. So we learned that the principal like had good intentions for the school. Yeah, he was trying to gather up like all the, the top, the, the brightest of the, and yeah. best of the best. Yeah, and make a show. Make a shelter for them so that they can live a kind of harmonious, peaceful unit inside the school. And also, we have two new discovery that's the All Star Reality Show. Oh, yes. <laughs> so, one of our plot twists is that this is all being broadcast and people can watch this. Yeah. Watch Murder at Copes Academy. Yeah. I mean,. I'd say this is a Monday Night hit show on Fox. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what kind of sick person would watch this show? Oh, I love this program. <laughs> <laughs> this is like the ultimate survival. Yeah, like you even said that. Like, like, like you watch these reality shows and this was like this. Yeah. <laughs> if Survivor had actual killers, like I vote Billy <laughs> and freaking sorry, I had to use your name there. Yeah, I don't know what name. Yeah. I vote Jimmy out, yeah. and Jimmy's like, okay, we feed you the sharks. Mm -hmm. Wait, what? I, I thought I'd just go home. No, oh, no, 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 no this you is signed waiver, buddy. <laughs> yeah, I'm the ultimate Survivor. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe do that with convicts on Death Row. We could have like that dinosaur movie we watched yeah. a long time ago. Remember that one? Jurassic Park or whatever. Yeah, dude. The... Jurassic games. games. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, basically the connect, right? Yeah. So the other thing we find out is that the student, everyone who's been in the school, has had an amnesia. Yeah. But more, but more than just amnesia. Oh yeah, so you forgot a whole good chunk of your <laughs> life here. <laughs> Which is crazy, and I do like that. It's like it doesn't matter how they got amnesia. That's not the point no. here. It's like what? Like it's like amnesia, but like it's yeah. So, and then we find out that the pictures that they were seeing was like, yeah, this was your flat past school life. You guys were happy friends. Yeah. This is, like, you guys aren't complete strangers. You knew each other. Yeah. <laughs> you guys were 16 happy friends that had a happy school life, and then this shit happened. Yeah. <laughs> and now you're killing each other. Yeah. <laughs> well, typical high school. Typical high school. Alright, so, uh, where are we in the plot here? <laughs> hey, the pictures. So we have the pictures. Yeah. And during the final trial, uh, <laughs> everyone has a picture, and there's just one thing off of it, though. So. Yeah. Like, each one has the picture, they're not in it. Yes. And obvious solution is, is who's is taking the, the fucking picture, you dumbass? <laughs> 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 and then the second thing that I kind of wanted to see if you get, so I kind of went back on it. Yeah, because I mean, you, you wanted to show me the pictures again, because like, the pictures went by pretty fast. They do. So. Um, I don't think you're supposed to catch this uh, until the end. Yeah. But I was gonna tell about those. One person in each picture who has. that you can't see. Yeah. One person's face is always obscured. Yeah. 
And spoilers, this person would be the mastermind. Then, then I'd be good. Which one? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so we figure out that Hope Speaks Academy is basically a shelter for the brightest minds and students. Um, who killed Student X? <laughs> ready for a plot twist? Are you ready for a plot twist? <laughs> <laughs> Student X has been dead this entire time. Pretty much killed off in like I think the first episode or two. Yeah. <laughs> and basically, how did we find this out, Billy? I want to see if you remember because you're the one who kind of pointed this out. Yeah, the morgue. The morgue. Mm. Those are ten dead bodies. But we only see nine. nine. And we all know which one it isn't, because <laughs> there should be, a, if it was the biker guy, it'd just be a stack of butter, right? There. <laughs> so that's when. I'm like, wait a second. Wait a second. Someone faked their death! Yep. <laughs> And who was the only other person that died that wasn't it for a trial or yeah. murder? <laughs> Junko! <laughs> Air fashionista! <laughs> and thus we solved the mystery of the mastermind right. and who killed student Agnes. But wait! There's, there's more! <laughs> <laughs> so. Apparently it's revealed that this is her master plan all along. She wanted them to find it, the truth behind all this. Because how delicious is despair knowing that you're killing your well-known friends. Yeah. It's like, yeah, you're just not going to change it. You just killed your friends. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, she plays one last game with them where... Um, she will take the side of despair, and they can take the side of hope. Mm -hmm. If any one of them votes for despair, everyone's punished, and their punishment is is that they have to live out their lives in, the, in school. Yeah. If they vote, all vote hope, then she will be punished. And unfortunately, her body is connected to a life support system mm -hmm. in the school, so. <laughs> The doors will open and they can leave, but they cannot live in the school. Yeah. Or use it as a shelter yeah. anymore. <laughs> so, in that situation, which one would you pick? <laughs> I'm like, oh, damn. <laughs> you know, also, we know that the outside is hell. Yeah. And also, we got the plan. Yeah, well, I was kind of getting to that, but... Oh, my bad, sorry. Yeah. So, Student X uh, is a military girl. Like, like a mercenary. Yeah, a mercenary. She joined a militia group when she was young. And her sister is the mastermind yeah. behind all this. <laughs> and they're part of an organization called the uh, Group of Despair. I forget their actual title name. Yeah. Like but they just want to cause despair for the world. Yeah. And this is what the world has fallen into. Mm -hmm. Yeah, everyone trapped in the whole world being... Monokuma masks! <laughs> <laughs> and, yeah, they're twins. Fraternal twins. Yeah, they're twins, which... I can yeah. that off. I'm like... And they... I was about to be like, well, there's another block show us. I'm like, like, they got to be related twins. Yeah. And you're like, damn. Yep. <laughs> yeah, you're calling all the plot twists for the last <laughs> area. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I like, totally forgot about the twin thing. Like, yeah, I don't think it's that huge of a detail. Yeah. We could have just said sisters, and I think. Yeah. But, yeah. It makes sense because of how it's played out. Yeah. It was, uh... The military girl dresses up as her sister in the fashion needs to, to infiltrate into the student body. Yeah. To uh, more 
control them <laughs> and not arouse suspicion of why is there two people missing from our 16 person yeah <laughs> And Junko, our mastermind, is like, well, my sister would never have the mind capacity to pull off this kind of master plan. Yeah. She's more military minded. So, I'm going to kill her. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't a partnership. This is a one man show. <laughs> That's right, we didn't use the who's line line. Looks like someone wants their own oh, show. show. <laughs> <laughs> and that's how officially Stuart X dies. Yeah. Sister betrayal. Yeah. Curse your sudden but inevitable betrayal. Then yeah. <laughs> <laughs> how crazy she was. Oh yeah. So I want to know your thoughts and opinions on Junko. Oh, shit. Because you like genocidal Jill. Yo, yeah, I love it. <laughs> this one takes us to an 11. Yes. I like Junko for how crazy she is. Yeah. I mean, they post a lot of, of dress, so... Um... Yeah, interesting uh, zoom-in camera guy. <laughs> yeah, like, um, is this kind of weird? No, I guess you're supposed to look there. <laughs> like, is this awkward? <laughs> Like, like, anime. It's, it's anime. <laughs> okay. It's anime, but the last Yeah, because you don't need to just say it's anime. Yeah. You can keep asking questions, I'm just gonna keep holding up my anime side. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, yeah, she has basically a multiple personality disorder <laughs> where she constantly changes persona <laughs> just at random. Oh, yeah. And I think she had five personas. Yeah? Yeah. Can you name them all, Billy? <laughs> Probably not. I will want that. Want to try an attempt? Honestly? No. Okay. I'm just... I can tell the difference in the voices. Yeah. But I just. I'm going hard to tell. Yeah. So there's the queen, the secretary, the small child, the psycho, and Monokuma. Okay. <laughs> yeah, anytime she's holding up the Monokuma. Monokuma no, yeah, I figured that. No, that's the Monokuma voice coming in. Yeah. Nice. And why is this significant, says everyone? Is how many punishments are there? Five. <laughs> <laughs> and why is this significant? <laughs> we'll find that out in oh, a moment. Oh, yes. <laughs> I love this. Well, this one to end. Wait till we tell you the time limit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, back to our uh, liberal dilemma of will you choose to leave or will you choose to stay here for eternity? <laughs> then, this gave the option. Yeah. A sacrifice. Yeah. So they can either kill Nagy. Yeah. And what was the stipulation if they do that? Blue yeah. one. I'll leave or something, something like. Oh, um, they would not be punished. They would just be on Nagy. Yeah. Their yes. their sins would all fall on Nagy. Yes. So it really comes down to Nagy versus Junko, hope versus despair. Yeah. As the dramatic uh, change in title of Nagy from ultimate lucky student to ultimate hope. Yeah. Isn't so dramatic in the anime, no. unfortunately. I like this better done in the game. Yeah, you mentioned that to me. I'm like, There's a lot more pop and circumstance to it. <laughs> that whole ending scene is a lot more pop and circumstances. Yeah. But. Yeah, now there's a ton of adapted uh, to an anime, and there's like a ton of gameplay that was part of that. Yeah. Anytime the bullets are flying, that was actually you in the game watching those bullets. Yes. Which is more satisfying than it needs to be. <laughs> I mean, that last shot hit her right. Right. <laughs> right. 
<laughs> well, not sad, but like, bam. Bam. Oh, man. Shattered. <laughs> So, um, in the end, Nyag has to convince everyone out of despair in that even if the world outside looks bleak, guys, we still gotta go out there. <laughs> I know it's nice and comfy in here and we could probably live a comfortable, full life, but is it really living? <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't know, I got food, shelter, and like... Or anything I can't yeah. eat. So. Yeah, really. Like, it's like a hard decision to make, right? It's a very hard decision. Like, that's the whole point. But eventually our uh, words reach through and our friends decide, hey, no, Nagy's right, we shouldn't live here. Mm -hmm. And Junko gets voted as the guilty party. <laughs> and it's punishment time. <laughs> And, and she I'm... is so happy about it. Oh, she! <laughs> it's like, she's like, I'm in a bad girl. I'm like, whoa! Yeah. Uh... <laughs> she is getting turned <laughs> on by this idea. And why to name the ultimate punishment? <laughs> the super nasty punishment. <laughs> the super nasty, nasty torture. torture. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> so... This is basically a combination of all punishments <laughs> into one. And I adore this scene. Oh, I love Like, that is awesome. Yes. And I don't know if you caught it, but did you notice that each punishment had a different one of her personas in it? No, I did not catch that one. Okay. That's a nice little touch. So it's killing off each persona. Oh, yeah. I, I like that, now that you bring it up. Yeah. It's very clever. It's very clever. <laughs> and then with the mastermind out of the way, the life support system in the school shuts down mm -hmm. and it's time to leave. Yeah. And open the door. And cue credits. <laughs> <laughs> we get one last uh, motivational talk about how hope there's yeah. always hope. You yeah. gotta search for it. <laughs> and come on, that's all my motivational. That's exactly yeah. the, the inspirational quote. <laughs> and then, kind of a teaser for the second game. I don't know. I have not played the second yeah. <laughs> game. That's the one I have not played. But. We find out that Monokuma was not actually being controlled at all. Yeah, no, like. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you thought I was just a puppet? That's fair. Everyone does. <laughs> <laughs> so, before we wrap this up, your final thoughts on Danganronpa? No, I mean I will enjoy you because I kept you guessing. Yes. And like this. A couple of like, the characters were very entertaining. Yes. I mean, and I warned you, it's not about off the wall craziness. No. That, this is why you picked this one for me, because you know. I, I, if I threw off the wall craziness at Billy, he would be not interested. No. Would you recommend this to people? Yes. Like, I'm. Like, I mean, I want you to. I want to give the game a try. Yes. And I'm almost tempted to track this down on DVD or Blu-ray. Nice. So, you know. Yeah, that's a, a huge standing ovation from Billy. It was like, I want to put this in the collection. Yes. <laughs> it might be your first anime put in the, the, collect, the collection. Yes. A uh, real mm -hmm, true man. Yeah. But... It already succeeded in what it's supposed to do. I believe the anime was just adapted to sell the game better. Because the game does flesh out a lot of those scenes much more yeah. clearly. And you understand so much more going on. Yeah. For me, um, I would say play the game if you can. Definitely before you watch the anime. Yeah. The anime does sum up way too much in my mind. But it's a fun anime to watch either way. 
And if you can't get tracked down the game or you can't afford the game, this is a good substitute to get the plot of the game. Yeah. But with that, though, that'll be anime month. I'm Devin. Billy? No, no, no. <laughs> I, I love that. Yeah. And until next time, I'm your damn host! <laughs> <laughs> I love that. <laughs>